guys, I'm 553 here, and uh, man, we're just taking a look at my house here real quick. I um, haven't really done much, uh, uh, too many videos on the updates on how my area on Corporal Bruno's server is doing, so I figured I would uh, we'll go ahead and show you guys a little bit of my house. Now, there's a chest, there's a chest up here, and uh, let's go see what what's in it. So obviously Bruno's been around, <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and take a look in the chest and see what's in this. Ooh, some pretty blocks, and a book. So we're gonna read the book, and it states on fire. I decided that your building was fantastic. I loved the stone blocks and the spruce together. I didn't like the front. So I'm in exchange for trying a different route. Here are some blocks. Bruno. Well, how nice of you to stop by. Thank you very much for stopping by and checking out my house. Um, I'm assuming that you probably checked it out when we were working on the sheep farm together, uh, which is going to be another entire video. I actually have an update on that as well for you. Um, because I've already uh, found out a new way to make a change there. but um, So we're taking a look basically at the front um, to see exactly what he means now. See where the stone is right next to the window. I have it around the edge as well. So I like the way it looks. I love spruce wood. Spruce wood's just that right brownness, the dark brown. So let's try something here with um, some blocks that he gave us. So we have gray, we have the light gray, yellow, brown, black, um, pink. <laughs> I don't know what I would use pink for. Um, it's not my favorite color. So let's see what yellow stained clay would look like here. Um, it, it has a nice contrast with the the spruce wood so I think I think if anything I might use the yellow clay I am also thinking about using the brown clay um, but, but it doesn't say brown actually um, yeah I can't think of the name of <laughs> off the top of my head right now oh, gray gray doesn't look great to me but then again I'm partially colorblind when certain colors mix, but these colors that I know that mix when I'm colorblind, when I can't see them, it's not in gray, but um, it looks more like a brown, so or a purple. It could look like a little bit of like a purple as well. So we're trying out and seeing how things look here. I'm definitely going to make use of these items that uh, Bruno has given me. Um, and you know what, we're going to be back in a bit, I'm going to try these out, try to see how things will look, and uh, I'll show you a little bit of progress along the way, and then the, um, the finished product of how I think it's, obviously I'm not going to finish the house in this episode, but um, we're going to try some things out with the new items that we got from Corporal Bruno, so we'll be right back with that.
Okay, guys, so um, I'm, I'm finished uh, toying around with these new blocks that Bruner gave me, and I was doing a little bit more cosmetic work on the house. Um, I figured out that uh, this, this dirt on the side needed to go, and I needed to to actually complete or completely around this edge here. I'm going to get rid of some of that dirt along the house as well, so I have a little pathway to go around it. And I put these half slabs of spruce around. I, I finished the um, tops and bottoms of the windows on the first floor with the stone. I think it has a nice look to it, and I used the, the brown, excuse me, the gray clay um, for around the windows as well. And then I'm making a stripe. So I think it looks a little bit better. Um, I might make some changes uh, depending. I'm also using some of that yellow uh, stained clay on the top. Um, I also put some half slabs of the stone around the edge of the openings on the second floor and half slabs below and above the yellow clay and then I put some half slabs on the sides. Basically what that's going to be up there is a third level. There's going to be a third level. Um, and I figured it would be pretty neat to have them as like a little bit of a, I guess a wing style, but they're going to be modeled after the windows down the bottom, um, which I think will give it a nice look. This is my first like real big house, so don't mock me. Over there's the sheep farm. Yes, it's a, it's a work in progress. Right now they're not growing the wool as fast as I would like it, so I figured out a way um, to fix that issue. So I've been toying around with it with a, in a uh, creative world and seeing how it would look. So, alright guys, well thank you very much for watching my video. Um, basically this is a response to, to Corporal Bruno because he stopped by and left me a nice little note. So if you like my videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel as well as give me a like if you really liked it. If you didn't like it, hit that dislike, but why would you? It hurts my heart just a little bit, but it doesn't bother me. Don't worry about it. Um, make sure you leave your comments down below. I am playing on Corporal Bruno's new server, craft.teambruno.org. So that's craft.teambruno.org. And I'm actually showing you the trailer video that I made for this server, so you should go check that out. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Stay awesome.